Hey guys, this is Paul with Agility Communications, and today we want to talk about conference bridges and setting that up on the IP office. And specifically, the feature that we're going to use is a conference meet me feature. Conference Meet Me has up to 128 conference channels and up to 64 conference members on any one conference bridge. It requires a preferred edition license. Um, if you have Voicemail Pro, then you have the preferred edition license or server edition. It's not available with the central edition license. So let's get started. First, I'm going to show you how to configure this inside of Manager. And I'm going to create three conference bridges today. I'm going to create 500, 501, and 502. Let me just select Conference Meet Me. Okay, and then we'll save that. So just taking that action there actually enables the feature, but at this point it's just internal. So we want to also make it available for people to call in from the outside. So we're going to go into incoming call routes. And here I have a DID that is not assigned to anything. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a short code that will pass these calls over to Voicemail Pro. And the reason for that is because we want to add PIN codes to our conference bridges to add a little more security. That's going to be voicemail node. Okay. And anytime we hand anything off to Voicemail Pro, it's going to be on a name basis, so we want to copy that name exactly the way it is listed here. So now I'm going to open up Voicemail Pro. And we need to create call flow under the short codes. So we'll add. We'll give it the same name, Conf Bridge. And that creates a start point. Now we need to create, actually build out the call flow. Let's do that. We need menu. We're also going to need variable routing. And we're going to need transfer. Three of those. One for each conference bridge that we created. is where we're going to create our pins. So each conference bridge is going to have a five-digit pin number, and each pin number, it's just one that I made up, is going to start with 7-8. And this will come together as you see me. Watch me build it out. Okay, this is where we're going to actually put the pin numbers that need to be matched. This will be dollar key. And we'll do 78 uh, to O. All right, so the way this works, call is going to come in. Now we need to connect these together. Call will come in at this start point. It will hit this menu. Anytime a caller dials 78200, 
call is going to go to a conference bridge. 201, and we'll go to the second bridge, and so on and so forth. So let's connect these up. And then here. And that'll be conference 500. This will be conference 501. This will be conference 502. Oh. And we just save and make live. Now, so the, the programming is actually done. You would need to take one more step and record a greeting here at this menu, because when the call hits here, you need a prompt that lets the callers know to go ahead and put in their PIN number. So you would double click on the menu, go to Entry Prompts, and you would right here call this Conf. And you would record the greeting. So I'm not actually connected to a live system, but you would have a telephony option here. And if you're sitting at a phone, just enter that extension that you're sitting at here and hit record. The phone system will call you on your desk phone and at that point you can record the greeting and the greeting would go something like, thank you for calling the Agility Communications Conference Center. Please enter your PIN code now. Once you have that sex, uh, successfully recorded, you can close, OK it, and save it and your conference bridges are now complete. Thanks for watching.